Hello everyone, in this video we will discuss the term palinode. Introduction The concept of palinode in poetry refers to a poem or poetic passage in which the poet expresses remorse or regret for an earlier poem or type of subject matter. It is an act of renunciation and retraction, a poetic form of self-correction or penance. Palinode poems have been used throughout literary history as a means for poets to reconcile with their past works, redeem themselves from controversial themes, or explore new perspectives on their creative expression. Origins and Purpose of Palinode The term palinode is derived from the Greek words palin meaning again and ode meaning song. The Palinode tradition has its roots in ancient Greece where poets would compose poems to retract or counteract statements made in earlier works. One of the earlier examples is found in Plato's dialogue Phaedrus where Socrates presents a Palinode expressing his reservations about poetry. The Palinode allowed poets to demonstrate growth, maturity, and a willingness to revise their beliefs or artistic choices. Chaucer's The Legend of Good Women as an elaborate palinode. An exemplary illustration of palinode can be found in Geoffrey Chaucer's The Legend of Good Women. Chaucer, known for his work Troilus and Cressid, and his translation of The Romance of the Rose, faced accusations of slandering women lovers in his previous works. In response, he wrote The Legend of Good Women, an elaborate and charming palinode. In this poem, Chaucer renounces his earlier themes and celebrates women who were saints in their fidelity to the creed of love, thus redeeming himself from the accusations of misogyny. Palinode in Love Poetry Palinodes are particularly common in love poetry where poets often experience changing emotions and perspectives on love and relationships. Love is a complex and ever-evolving emotion and poets frequently explore its various facets through their verses. The Elizabethan poet Sir Philip Sidney, in his sonnet Leave Me, O Love, which reaches but to dust, offers a palinode by renouncing the poetry of sexual love in favor of family or divine love. This shift in focus represents a transformation in the poet's outlook on love and spirituality. Conclusion The palinode in poetry serves as a powerful literary device that allows poets to revisit and reassess their past works. It demonstrates their capacity for growth, introspection, and willingness to reevaluate their artistic choices. Whether motivated by remorse, a desire for redemption, or a change in perspective, the palinode enriches the poet's body of work and provides readers with a deeper understanding of the poet's evolving thoughts and emotions. So this was the discussion on the term palinode. We will meet in the next video and discuss some other term. Until then, goodbye and thank you. Hello everyone. Welcome to this series on literary terms and literary theory. If you want to study the notes and MCQs related to this term, you can click the link given in the description. We are also going to start our online and offline classes for UGC NET for English literature very soon. So stay connected with us.